have any new practice facilities going to be right here? Man, it's going to be awesome. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful side of, the, of uh, Manhattan and great location, not far from the arena, so I'm very excited about it. As far as what you're going to have here versus what you had in Jersey, what do you think it's going to compare? Well, you don't really know until all the construction's done, but I, they don't do anything um, without doing it right. So I'm very, as you can see, Barclays is one of the, the nicest venues in the NBA, and then I'm sure this will be just the same. What do you think about the view just up here? Oh, it's beautiful. I was telling Billy I, I want an apartment with this kind of view, so <laughs> uh, I have a practice facility with it. Now we got to get the apartment with it. <laughs> what, what is it? I mean, obviously the arena's really nice. Yeah. And I know we've got plans to... to really do this place up what do, you, what do you envision it being like when it's final? Really, I mean, I think they're they're creating a, you know, a place where guys are going to want to be here. I mean, naturally, as basketball players, you want to be in the gym anyway, but it looks, there will be no reason to leave. I mean, yeah, <laughs> I'm sure they'll have, we have uh, chefs and all that, so um, really, you'll be here in the off season, you'll be here in season, it'll be, it'll be awesome. And you see the drawings and renderings and stuff like that, what do you think about those? Those are unbelievable, man. If, they, if it looks half as good as the pictures, we'll be, we'll be all right. <laughs> have, you, have you thought at all about a year ago today? Yes, a lot, actually. So a couple of my buddies are getting drafted tonight, so I'm going to go watch and support them. It's kind of weird to think about. It is, man. To think how much has happened in one year. It feels like yesterday I was, you know, picking out a suit for draft night, and now I'm one year in, and I'm loving it. I love Brooklyn, and uh, it's a fun time. I'm just telling, like, one of my close friends is Rodney Hood. I'm just telling him, enjoy it. You don't know where you're going to end up, no matter what anybody tells you. So just enjoy the, the night, and it's a lot of fun. Do you think uh, more players would be apt to live in Brooklyn now? Absolutely. Start? I know um, myself, I'm looking at moving into Brooklyn um, once the facility is done. But I don't, I, mean, I don't see any reason to live in Manhattan when you know, Brooklyn has a lot to offer. So. You're going to go to the Summer League, obviously. Yeah. Uh, what about that? What do you hope to, I guess, accomplish there? Win a game. <laughs> I don't know. About that, yeah. yeah, we had a rough go at it last summer. Um, but, you know, I'm looking for I love I love summer league, even though we didn't do so well. Um, myself, Marcus, uh, Jorge, um, we got three three solid guys right there. And then I haven't met the other guys yet, but I'm sure we'll have a good team. Are you, are you going to be at, are you gonna be over in the draft room in the room with this guy tonight? Yeah, or? they let me in. I'm going to be in there. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. So just be there to support him, and hopefully we get a pick. Maybe. Hopefully we end up with him. So. Have you seen this space before? Have you been here? You know, I actually had. I had just driven down here. I was, you know, bored one weekend, so I heard it was down here. Came to check out the building, but I had never been up on the floor though, so it's very. Um, I didn't realize how big it was. And the right place, you think you envision right now it's sort of like a yeah it'll be unbelievable i mean having having a rooftop lounge like that's that's crazy <laughs> when a team has a nice practice facility is that something that kind of gets around the league and oh yeah help? and the other thing all these draft i mean even though i have an experience free agency when you go through the draft process i worked out for 15 teams so i i had a good feel like oh when i'm a free agent i probably don't want to go to this city <laughs> you know this team has a brand new state-of-the-art everything um, the city has a lot to do with that, but then also where you're going to go to work every day has a lot to do with that. So um, it, it is a big deal, like Billy said, in attracting free agents. Now they'll have to bring all those guys back in and show off the new place, but um, I mean, who wouldn't want to work in a place like this? I know you said all last season that working on your uh, outside game would yeah. be something. Is It'll be it? huge, yeah. And I mean, that's already started. Since the end of the season, I've been in the gym getting up shots and. Um, it's, it's, it'll come, you know. Um, summer league will be good to get it in live action, but it's just a lot of repetition, a lot of um, you know, just staying in the gym. There's, there's no, it's just work. I was so. going to say, we're going to see some of summer league. Oh yeah, definitely, definitely. Billy has said that obviously, as of right now, KG is coming back. It looks yeah. like so. What did that do for you? I, I mean, he helped you a lot last year. So yeah. he comes back one more year. What did that do for you? It, it does nothing but help me. He's the, he's the best veteran to have as a rookie in the league. Um, gas the other the other young guys that, that have played with them but um, it's I was so happy when I heard that because it's only going to help me you know another year with him another year of learning um, it's a blessing